Good evening, Hornets fans. We have a bit of a surprise match tonight. I know it wasn't up on the stream schedule, but uh, our opponent um, had a little bit of an issue uh, health-wise with their cat, so we had to reschedule and kind of played it by ear. Uh, but it sounds like their cat's doing okay, which is which is good. Anyway, um, meanwhile, my cat is standing at my door screaming at me for food, even though I just fed her 20 minutes ago. Anyways... We are not buying anything here. They're going to get quite a few inducements. Um, originally, we were even, pretty evenly matched in team value, uh, like almost exactly. But then last match, the Arctic Enforcers lost, or well, got missed next game on a pretty key blitzer and a pretty key black work. Um, yeah, looks like bribe and then leveling them up to give them 30 player. Yeah, going for cause and pain it looks like so this will be fun um i apologize in advance if the stream goes down i'm gonna try to pay attention to it something up has been up with stream labs lately and uh my streams have just been crashing midstream so i apologize in advance if that happens it always seems to happen when something interesting is happening on the field All right, I think the plan for this one, I thought of a plan a couple days ago and I was really excited about this. Uh, but yeah, I thought about a plan and now I've promptly forgotten it. Um, I think because he was so bashy, I was going to try to receive first and score slow and then stall him. That doesn't matter. He gets to choose. Ooh. Oh, no. That's their fan roll. No, this is bad. So, we got 15k. All right. They didn't double us. 21k. But they, uh, they got a lot of fans for this. I suppose my fans didn't want to show up even at my own home stadium because uh, all the, the orc fans in the stadium, they ruin the experience, make it all smelly and whatnot. So... Looks like, yeah. Definitely be getting some fouls in, which is problematic. We do have a bench, though. So he is kicking to me, which I, I think is what we were going to pick anyways. So kind of works out. I thought he'd start with a stronger line. He can absolutely, I mean, he could throw more guys on the line and overpower me. But I may, uh... I may actually punch some of these guys now. He's kicking to me. Let's get Ren back here. I want to remember he's not that fast. He doesn't have a goblin, so he can't launch a goblin back there to steal the ball, at least. Um, do we have a we have a niggling injury lineman. Let's get him off the field. He's benched. Actually, I think I want my kicker saved. Actually, no. Where's my strength up, dude? Can clobber him, clobber him, clobber him. After we clobber these guys, do we send somebody up the middle? No, because that guy's going to go murder them. So I think what we do is we send Hawk. Mm, probably at him. There's some sort of blitz. Also, just in case there's some sort of blitz. Just 
So is anyone in need of a vanity pass? Hawk kind of is, but I'm not going to try it with him. Alright, I think I'm okay with that. Eh. Quick snap helps. I don't know if moving here really helps me out at all. The troll does not go back, the troll goes down. up too far, it's going to be dangerous. <laughs> Fine by me. Let's him. Here's the thing. We could send a defender or a receiver down here once we block him. Then he's just going to get pummeled. Let's try to keep people protected somewhat. Hey, good to see you in here, Killer Clan. Oh, sorry, my dog's going nuts trying to keep the cats out of the room. She thinks uh, she's a guard dog. Uh, I'm not sure where we want to put him. One, two, three. See a frenzy. I'll see frenzy. I'm gonna go there. Does have juggernaut, just not frenzy. There we go. Nice. <laughs> All right, we've picked up the ball. All right, this seems fine. I have some people who are probably gonna get blitzed. Actually, this is the main one I'm worried about. It's either of, well, be hard to blitz him successfully. Could blitz him, could blitz him, or any one of those linemen.
My main worry about this match is the pain that they are going to cause to my players. <laughs> but I guess that's, that's to be expected against orcs. Okay, cool. Blitz is used on a lineman. Offered up the uh, niggling injury lineman. Luckily, he rolls double ones on the injury, so niggling injury doesn't really uh, hurt us at all. See if he's gonna get stuck in anymore. See, that was smart of him. He marked two players there, so I can't bash my way through. Well, three players there. Well, well. That really feeds me this... I feel like this is bait now. Um... I kind of want to go after him. There's a lot of guard there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eh, I wouldn't be able to hit him from the angle I want to. So maybe we're not going to blitz that guy. But I still like running out there. Oh, there we go. We KO'd him. We do have a way out. This is good. Alright, we can clobber that guy, but I think we want this guy to go free to go help with ball things. We'll dodge back with him. What are we looking at blitzing here? Suppose I have wrestle tackle. really don't want to hmm. it might just end up pushing him there two three four five six then I can blitz him I think I'm okay with that one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Two, three, four, five, six. So, nope. 
and that actually messes things up a bit. Pop him loose. Is anyone here actually a threat? Hmm. Move him up a little bit. I want to go that way. I don't think it helps. Now, if he gets blitzed, he could run right through. But that's okay. I think I'm going to leave that as bait. Hey, Chinchiro. Glad to see you guys in here. Love the support. We're going to need it to beat these orcs. Don't tell Stubings, but I'm playing very scared. Illadar holds up. I'm assuming he's going to put him here, and then he's going to have him blitz there. Or there, and then blitz there. Both of them work. So he is coming for Hawk. I tried to step back a square, but he's still coming. Oh, that'll take him down. Oh, he cancels Fend. Oh, no. Oh, man, I'm, I'm really worried about that. Um, let's come back to relative safety. Oh, no. I, oh, man, Juggernaut cancels Fend. That's terrifying. Oh, man, but I, he survives. Wow. That... Depending on how some of this goes, that is a potential foul target, I would say. We have linemen nearby. I may risk a foul on that. Yeah. Oh, seven mighty blow is terrifying, Grunter. But yeah, nothing like a palm hit on a 175 star player point piece. <laughs> this guy wasn't here, I'd almost get the ball to him and shoot off. Nobody could catch him with all his movement. Oh no. Oh no. Go away. Stop it. Stop it. Ugh. Good thing he's a he's a blitzer. Um, this is weird. I don't really want to score yet. 
I suppose I can run away from this. I mean, if we could blitz, dodge out, blitz that guy, that might be good. This guy's strength five. We're gonna we're gonna have to do a lot of dodging away. Thing is, is that going to be our blitz? I think it will be. Yeah. If he goes down, we can move him up, get the ball to him, run downfield. I like the sounds of it. I think that's what we're going to do. Hopefully we can knock him down. Cool, we do. Actually, with all that guard, I guess they can just step up there anyways. Get the ball there. Shoot around. Keep him there till we get the ball up. Keep them there. There's a lot of stuff I don't... Yeah, I want to get the ball up there first. It's tempting to pass for the SPP, but... A little too early for vanity passes. We can mark that there. We still got this open ground. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. As long as we stay like right about here, we should be good. Uh oh. That was scary can mark him with him. That's about it. Going there doesn't really help. Willing to mark him. They can do a two plus to get to the ball. Run up that way as well. Dodge reroll saves us there. Let's see if jump up. No. If we risk two dodges, I don't know, we could put another mark on him, but it doesn't really help. Four, five, six. That doesn't really help either. So let's let's just go here. Keep him marked. Keeps Hawk a little safer. Okay, cool. Yep, bringing in a guard piece. 
figured that would come in there. H Hawk is still alive. He's over here. He got hit by a pilot by this piling on piece. He piled on him, roller skater, and then this guy came over and fouled him. But he he didn't even get stunned. Never broke his armor. So we're very, very lucky. The hawk is also hard as nails. Knock on wood. If hawk could maybe just cause a casualty. Yeah, I mean, he's... He's had his injuries. As you can see here. Broken neck, smashed knee, plenty of badly hurts. And among other things that the apothecary saved, but... It'd be pretty cool to get him to Legend. If he wasn't Agility 3, I'd do a quick Vanity Pass. But I haven't had a game where uh, I've been ahead enough to risk a Vanity Pass with him. Ooh, the big killer comes for Illidar and takes him down. Uh, let's... If we go this way, we're 1, 2, 3, 4. We're te technically closer to fouling range, so let's... Let's bring the Fowler over this way. Ooh, might not need to. There's a stun. We'll see the piling on. Okay, it stays. trap him in yeah he might force a score here will you leave him alone come on double ones all right yes yeah, what a double threes that works um Can we... Can we really defend against this? Maybe one more turn. I kind of like buying us one more turn. But we do have some stuff to break out of then. He positions his guard very well. So if we go there, we're going to have to do a dodge to get out of things. But I think it's somewhat reasonable. As long as he makes his dodge out of there. There's no tackle on him. I suppose he could have just gotten us a two-die block there. And I just ran away. <sighs> Alright. I don't know if it's worth one more turn. I've got a bad feeling about this. I should just run in. I should just run in. But I'm not going to because I'm greedy for one more turn of stalling. Two, three, four, five, six. Okay. We've we've caged him up. We didn't blitz at all. We should be smart about this and 
get a blitz in here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Not sure going that way really helps us a whole lot. Maybe we do dodge that way and hit him. Now do we punch him? We go smack him. I like that more. Ooh, come on. Removal? No, just stun. That's alright. Now, yes, he'll be able to get things up there, but I like this a lot more. Well, he can smack somebody there, but that's fine. Okay, now this guy can go one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, yeah. So, he'll have to do some sort of blitz and mark me. Now, what he can do is he can foul Hawk, which is still worrisome. Hey? Question mark? Oh no. Depending on what other assist he brings up here, I feel like Hawk's gonna blitz him for sure. As long as I don't quad skull on the blitz. Is it Hawk who's nearly a legend? Yes, yes it is. Oh no, this guy's getting clobbered. You're a really nice lineman, don't get hurt. Oh no, just a stun. Ah! Son of a bitch. Uh, he's really nice. There's still a lot of a game to go. All right. We'll, we'll 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 drop some team value. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's it's too early, and I I mean, he's just a lineman. He is a lineman with garden block, and boy does he help with early line of scrimmage blocks. But ultimately, he's just a lineman. He, he doesn't get the apo. Interesting. That does make this a little harder. I may need to, well, if I dodge out of there, I guess I get the free reroll first. I'd like to get a blitz in on this guy. All right, so we're not gonna do anything with him. He's one, two, three, four, five, six. He's probably fine. Yeah, he helped. <laughs> Oh no. Stop fouling him! At least it's not Hawk. I don't think he can help too much, so let's just put you there. Stand you up. Now here's, here's the thing. I'd really like to blitz him. So he's got tackle, and also he's a nice piece, and I'd like to hurt him. If I blitzed with Hawk, I'd get the mighty blow. So I think I'm willing. To... Don't. No, my God! 
Uh, well, I guess I'm glad I did it with him instead of the other guy. Man, of course, the first roll of the turn is double ones. Yep. Oh, boy. And there goes our guy who can steal the ball back. Please just be a push. Please just be a push. Nope, it's down. Man. See? Oh, my God. Here we go. Ah. <sighs> Literally any move I would have done there was going to fail. I don't... I couldn't have done anything better than a 2+, plus because dodging out... Yeah. Dodging out, I would have used up a reroll and failed. I couldn't get a 2-die block. I guess I just shouldn't have stalled, but, like, I don't know. If it wasn't for double ones there, it would have been a really effective stall. Yeah, I agree, Gunner. That's it's the way pro elves go. They live or, live or die by the two plus, and we are most certainly dying by it now. Man, so what's our who do all do we have out now? We've got Pytho KO'd. We've got Dead Lineman, Thantaldes. Our nice one turn score guy is out for the game. My lineman. What lineman? That This lineman down here, I ran up. No, the one that marked loner DP, uh, that's what I checked the first time. He didn't have enough movement to get up there without doing a go, go for it, or a dodge. Because that's the first thing I checked. Um, so now we're going to try to get the ball back from him, which is possible, though if he makes this go for it, which he does, uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know about getting in there now. Yikes. We are, we are in a bad spot. Oh my god, there we go. This is what I get for stalling. Should have walked it in when I had the chance. I mean, 1 in 36, I've had it like go bad and be like, oh man, alright, now we gotta recover. But this, this went bad and turned into... It turned into this in one turn. <laughs> like, what the hell? Uh... Alright, I... Uh... Huh. So, what... If we could step here, we could hit him. And we gotta hope it's a knockdown. Maybe we could get away and, and blitz there. Um, we, we can't, we can't bring anybody here around or in. This is looking awful. Um. I guess let's try to bring him up a little bit. He might be able to help somewhere. Whew. Yeah, this is absolutely horrid. Um. We step in there. What do we do with these guys? I, I guess recovery. Can we do any funky blitzes to chain? No, because we want to blitz the ball carrier. That's the thing. Okay. I don't really know what to do with these guys until I see what happens to the ball. So we're going to try to... Don't you roll another one. Oh my god, man! Oh. Holy crap.
And you know what? Moving there just blocked his blitz anyway, so I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, it is a knockdown at least. Um, if I follow up, his blitz is completely blocked, so I guess I stay. Uh, I still don't know what to do with these two. I guess they're in an okay enough spot as it is. Well, here we go. shouldn't have stalled. No matter how nice the stall looked, I shouldn't have stalled. <laughs> this is what I get. I could have walked it in. All I would have had to do is screen him. I felt confident enough to screen him for four turns. I didn't feel confident enough that my L screen could last five turns. But I felt confident about that stall. But... <laughs> that's that's true. He can't pile on. On my turn. That's uh You got to look at the 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 little the little blessings. 2 3 4 5 6. Oh, yeah. Why would he cage there? He has a perfectly good cage right there. You know, this would be awesome if we had the guy who can get the ball loose, Pytho, but no, he got KO'd. Like, in one turn, not only did we lose the ball, but we lost our players who are able to get the ball back. It was, like, just an utter loss. So there he goes. Who might be problematic. Can he... So in two more turns, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Go for it, go for it, go for it, go for it. He can't make it. This guy can't either. So I suppose this is our threat piece we got to take care of. Though I'd still like to do something about this. If we could somehow get Hawk to... Though he's probably going to keep it nice and blocked off this way. Yeah, we are not going to be scoring, and we're going to have to kick off to him. Down players. This is... Even if we do well this drive and we stop him from scoring, I think this is looking like a 1-0 victory in, in his favor. Well, 1-0 defeat for us. Well, that's just a poor line. That can go beat up on him. Just thinking about it. I hope he fails his go for it. Gets pushes, that's also fine. <laughs> huh. Will you quit fam? <laughs> I mean, I know that's his job, but knock it off. <laughs> um No, we can't we can't come in from that angle because of this guy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, it's too much, too much dodging and stuff. So let's run around this way, maybe. Too much guards, not gonna let me in here. I think I want to hit him from this way. Oh man, but I really need someone to go stop him. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're gonna run here for now. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Run him there. I'm not sure even coming over to this side is gonna help. So let's just. I 
guess so. Feels like we're just bunching up too much. Uh, we'll dodge him out when we get a sec. Right now, I want to go here. Cool, at least we didn't roll a one there. If we would have rolled another one, I would have been pissed. Uh, you know what, we blocked our... Well, I suppose we could do that. We have more sidestep spots. Cool, it is a knockdown. Follow that up. Too bad he doesn't have diving tackle. I'd love to have Hawk there instead, but... Oh well. See no reason to go to this side. Also on the bright side, uh, my turns are taking fewer than two minutes instead of my normal four. I did leave this side really easy for him to run that way, but <clears throat> we're going to have to at least mark this guy if we can't. We don't really have a good blitz on him. Since this guy that block, I'm not going to risk a one die. I think I'd rather just mark him. Well, it's a knockdown. So, yeah, you sidestep. I suppose. Though that's going to give him a plus one on the blitz. Or er, on the foul. If I go there, he's going to get a bonus on the foul, too. I guess I have a threat on this side. Well, now he can reach me. I should have went over this way, because then the fowler couldn't reach me. I just fed myself right to the fowler. What am I doing? If he dies or something, it's my stupidity that caused it. Where's he gonna... He's thinking real hard. Because he's gonna have to make a pass. This guy, with the agility 4, he's probably gonna be able to do the pass. The key thing is making sure this guy can't... receive. If he does score, and we go into the second half, kicking off to him, down one, uh, I don't think there's any way we could come back. If Pytho wakes up, we might be able to get a steal. Try to make up for this, but... <sighs> yeah. I, don't, I don't even think he needs to protect that side. What am I going to do? One die blitz this guy? No. Oh, that's another KO. It's stupid. I could have been out of range of the Fowler and I jumped right into it to try to get away from assists. So here's the thing. I can't I can't stand up to this guy with the blitz. So Emrador just Get in his way. Try to do an intercept or something. Now we can put Hawk on this guy. And that's pretty key. I feel like I'm... Well, no, I'd block off that spot. Might be willing to go there. I think I would be willing to go there. Pretty key that I do. But I need... And I gotta do this blitz first before I move him. 
if I can blitz him out of the way, then I can run through here, get where I want to go. Uh, this is turn eight. I'm not getting the ball loose. We are not scoring. I don't I guess I could dodge in there, but there's, there's too much guard. So we hit it from the front. I don't think we can do that. So yeah, you just run over here, away from the Fowlers and stuff. We just gotta stop him from scoring. That works. Now you, you go here. Um, everyone else is kind of taken care of. Where can we put you? Um, do you help out there at all? Not really. But I don't want to get hit by Mighty Blow. We're already short players to begin with. Alright. Well, let's see what he can do. <clears throat> He's got a clear Hawk out of there. Which uh, he can do with a 3 die block from the Troll. Which will hopefully be Skull Skull both down. Now he'll live with the 2 die from him. Looks like... Yep, he gets a knockdown. Uh, sure. Yeah. Alright, this guy's blocking there. They're blocking the center. I go there. He's got a tougher time getting through. Well, somewhat. I guess he doesn't really. He's already used his blitz, so I'll... It seems like I'll have a shot at the intercept. Oh, unless he does that first. Ah, oh, shoot, he makes it away. Oh, man. Watch this. He's gonna freaking score. Oh, he's still got two, or he's still got a reroll left for this turn, too. Come on. I, I need you to roll some ones here. Okay, there's a one. There's a one. Even if the pass is just inaccurate and flies out of bounds or whatever, that's also fine. No, it's a six. It's a six. Oh, thank Nuffle he failed that catch. Oh. Ah, that's... Well, okay. Out of the two that woke up... Well, I didn't want him to wake up, but... Out of the two that woke up, I wanted Pytho to wake up the most. <sighs> this is, uh, this is tough. These are some key players. I mean, most of my elves are leveled up, so you could argue that all of them are key players, but still. Um, do we, do we have another lineman to throw on the line? If we want to kick... Okay, it is unlikely that we will be able to stall for eight turns. 
So, I'm thinking we do kind of like a short kick, and we try to go in pretty heavy with, like, Pytho and them and whatnot. I think whoever's on the line is kind of going to be screwed. I... Emrodor is... For right now, this play, Emrodor is the guy to put on the line. But I'm loath to put Emrodor on the line. So... Can't put too much on that side. He'll set up too heavy on that side. Hmm. Do we have anything to reverse this side? Not really. So let's do that just in case. I still feel like he's going to set up heavy on this side because he knows that's where I'm kicking. a lot heavier on that side. Still, though. Where? Keep... Yeah, that guy. That guy's a problem. Because he has sure hands. Yeah, kicking deep. Still doesn't... Yeah. Let's see. We kick over here. It's kind of risky. He's got all those black orcs. That's the thing. The side he has blitzers. I feel a little better about this side. All right, they get an extra reroll. You don't know how you feel about the name of the orc team? Is this just Stubings joining in on the stream, trying to to keep cover? No. I really thought with Arctic Enforcers it'd be more of a blue color scheme. Well, yeah, I guess there's some blue in there. That's a nice push. Hopefully this is also a push. Ah, he doesn't have tackle. So it is a push. Oh god, but he just feeds him to the troll. And if he follows up, now the troll gets to eat him. Ooh. That was nice. We ate up his extra reroll. They still hear font color too. <laughs> That's hilarious. Emrador is going to get marked, maybe even blitzed. Oh, please don't blitz Emrador. No, <laughs> he's an important player. Leave him alone. Oh, yeah, I love this. Okay, this is great. I'm glad you blitzed him. Look at Emrador holding up. Biggest mistake, don't blitz my thrower. 
If he can throw that ball that far, he can certainly throw a punch. All right, we can mark him. Problem is, what's our recovery? He kind of has to be the recovery. Doesn't he? Yeah. All right, let's go get ourselves. All right, let's go mark. Actually, this guy, eh, it's riskier, but he might be able to get out there. All right, you're trapped. Um, still not a great angle. I'd rather shove him that way. Can't quite do that. Unless we... Is there any good leaps? Not really. They put us next to... Uh... Hmm. I think we have to trust in Verfenden. Um, let's not give up too much of this. Yeah, I don't really want to mark him either. Okay, this is going to be a, some riskier die rolls, but, eh, no, I want to bring him over here. Okay. I don't know if we can make that any better. <sighs> All right, we got to use up the reroll really early. But either way, we're going to have to do two two pluses. Okay, that's cool. Two plus, two plus, or four plus reroll, three plus. Uh, yikes. Don't roll it one. He rolls a friggin' one. I should have just stayed still. No way. Oh my god. Ah, uh, yeah, that's an apo. Sorry, don't, I don't mean to be salty, but I'm salty. <laughs> Not at Stubings, just at these dice. Man. Alright, he's got a pause. Whew. That'll give me a second to calm myself down. So what was that? That was a one. I don't know. I guess I could have... This would have had a reroll, but there were a lot more dice involved. I would have much rather failed the pickup than the the go for it there. So we've used up our Apo. And uh, we have Pytho out for this half. That's really bad. Or well, not for this half, but for this drive. If they get the ball back, I'm not going to have much to stop them. I'm going to have to try to stall them for that many turns. Uh, that's not good. So what, they can clobber him.
I assumed, because he said we're good. Yeah. yeah. Um. So, he can blitz him off. It might be a little harder for him to get to the ball, at least. Just a push helps. I assume he's going to try for the go for it and the pick up. Oh, no. It's not good. It's really not good. I mean, I suppose he's not, he's not dead. Jeez, yeah, even if he fails the pickup, like, I don't, because of this, I don't have any sort of recovery, unless Imthorn can, Imtheron can make some really awesome dodges. Looks like, is he going to foul him? Oh, after he pummers poor, pummels poor Immerdor. Okay. Whew, just a stun. I think Imtheron is going to have to make some really good rolls here. good positioning that's gonna make my dodges really weird oh yeah that pretty much settles it I don't know how I'm gonna get through there oh he gets the ball huh all right we've we've got no way in there I suppose I could, like, do that. I don't know. Is that even worth it? I can't even really mark him. Um, now that'd be a one-die blitz. Very good positioning on Stubing's part. we go, we might get ourselves trapped in there. That's what I want to avoid doing. <laughs> nope. <laughs> First roll of the turn. It's a one again. Uh, I don't think we can use a team reroll on that. And it's a stun. Whew. 
I am uh, I'm excited to play some elves later in the season. There's a lot of elves in this uh, division. I want to I want to be the one doing the punching and not receiving the punching. All right, so it looks like one, two, three, four, five. He's gonna go there. Cage up. We don't have Pytho to leap in. Plus, he has a ton of guard and sure hand, so I'm not sure if we do it. If we could, I'm not. We definitely don't have enough players to just screen for however many turns so i i suppose we try to get hawk on the ball carrier hope diving tackle works out <laughs> if he can survive this oh my apothecary's gone please don't kill hawk i just want him to be a legend Whew. okay that's nice. Though now there's tackle on Hawk, so dodging away is going to be a lot less likely to work. I still think we come in and blitz him with our strength four. Yeah, we don't need tackle or anything like that to do it. Well, maybe we do that, but maybe... We try the one. D well, unless he moves someone there, that's going to be really hard to do. Yeah, he's making sure he gets his positioning just right. Or maybe he's just making orc noises. Yeah, that's, that's pretty solid positioning. I don't entirely know. Yeah, he gets clobbered. <laughs> That'll do it. With stand firm, I won't be able to mark him at all. Is there any sort of way I can dodge in there? Get something. Uh oh. If that troll gets there, it's gonna be problematic. Ooh, that's nice. He's done. It's very helpful. We still have tackle zones on him, so what's our way in? If we dodge, we won't be able to dodge in there. Too many players. If we could get a knockdown, we could dodge him out, put him there. I'm not sure if it's worth it. But what else are we going to do? Falling back and trying to screen just isn't, isn't a viable option right now. See if we can take him down. I don't know. That's all I can see. Okay. We at least get the knockdown. Stun helps. Now. As much as I don't like sending Hawk in there. What do we do with him? Do we just bring him back for the moment? Yeah, because even if he's right there, he'll get the two die blocks he wants. Um... Let's 
try to get some help back here. I don't know. Is it worth using that reroll? It, it, it doesn't feel worth it. Now it kind of feels like it would have been worth it. I suppose if we use that reroll, that uh, that injury very well could have been Hawk trying to dodge out of there. This is rough. In Blitz, I can use Fend. Whew. Remador's still going to be trapped in there. He doesn't really have to gain a lot of ground. He's got plenty of time to score. Nice and slow. Stop it! Leave Hawk alone! Come on, double ones. Get that Fowler out of there. Seven's fine. So here's the thing. I could run around, blitz him, mark him. Even if I stayed on him, it's just a 2 plus to dodge out of there. This is the guy with tackle, which is going to make this dodge harder. So I suppose I'll just try to blitz him out of there. <laughs>
Okay, now there's no tackle. Still gonna fail it. Okay. Whew. Okay, Emmerdor, let's see if we can get you out of here. At least he didn't get hurt there. I think this guy is going to be Blitz and Hawk. He has to be... Maybe if he gets up here, we might, we might be able to force an earlier score and then... Maybe try for a one turn. If we're super lucky, we might have time for a two turn. But I don't. I doubt he's gonna score and give us a two turn. than a KO. No. Okay. Whew. That's that's safe. That's okay. Um, well, at least Hawk will live. We don't... Yeah, even our strength four, we don't have any sort of blitz... You know, at this point, KO is fine. <laughs> I don't, uh, all right. Can't really put pressure on the ball any of those ways. We can go here. All right, you know what I'm going to do? Oh, I guess I could have blitzed that, but you know what I'm going to do? I don't want to blitz this just to put him there, but first, I'm going to foul that guy. <laughs> Get him out of there. Nope. Almost. Eight, nine. All right. Pow. I'll reroll that one. Um, at least, unless they, uh, 
blitz him, they're going to be doing the block with a guy who doesn't have blocks, or maybe they'll roll like both downs or something. Even if they did, I, I don't think that would change the game a whole lot. Got three players left. I don't, I don't think there's much we can do. Even if we get the uh, one turn attempt. I don't know. I guess we get four guys back. We could have seven. It's still a pretty sorry one turn attempt, especially because our uh, movement nine guys out. Well, make that our kicker, too. I, I apologize for whoever has to face these star player point fed orcs <laughs> in the rest of the season. I have I have absolutely fed these orcs. Might be able to get a one die on this black orc in the corner and mark him up. Well, as long as my strength four doesn't get clobbered by this blitz. Ugh. Nope. There goes that idea. Uh, let's go this way. And piling on. Probably piling on. Get some star player points. No. He didn't use piling on. Do we have one player on the field? We do. Oh my god. <laughs> it's all up to you. Tal de go Tal de however you say his name. Tal Gadoran. Tal de Gadoran. <laughs> huh. This is uh it's definitely interesting. Try to get ourselves out of here. Now nah, that'll uh, that'll do it. Hey, there he goes. He did it. We got a pitch clear. What what's he doing? It's a pitch clear. Is he gonna throw the ball? Oh man, I would love it if he tries to throw the ball and it fails and then he can't pick it up. That would be amazing. Why else is he moving if he's not going to do some sort of throw here? Ah, I can see trying to score with his black orc. Alright, this is good. He'll reroll that. Come on, let's see another one or two. One or two. Nope, that's a five. That, that, that gets him it. I was really hoping his greed there would, uh, would get him. But nope. All right, so he's going to walk that in with his black orc, get a nice level. This spells no one turn. <laughs> nice KO wake ups, but they It's not not enough to to do anything really cool. So I guess we're just gonna try for a vanity pass. Yeah. See who we can hurt. Yeah, 
yeah, that's a smart setup because I have no chance at. Uh, All right. Well, that is game. Oh, that was rough. At least we got some okay winnings. Um, it's an all right MVP. I'm okay with that. Uh, let's validate this. Oh, I should have looked at the the stats. I meant to do that. All right, uh, nobody leveled up, but our team value definitely went down. Oh boy. Luckily, it was, it was what, it was only linemen that died? They're repurchasable. So I guess everyone else is kind of okay. Um, so what, we're down two players for next game? I think think we buy a lineman well let let's go look at what our next game's gonna be maybe we want the loners to be meat shields because who knows what we're playing next well actually i think we're playing epical one and his elves delicious elves yeah pretty sure that's him nope there they were yeah all right all right I mean, he does actually have some, somewhat of a killer there. His one-off team's pretty brutal looking, if I'm being honest. Yeah, it's pretty good. Hopefully, you know what, who's he playing this week? Maybe they can put some, some herd on him. Um... Bless yourself. Naturally chaotic. That's um, the Ca Tater Spyro's chaos team. Caused some injuries. We could, we could see a little pain caused. So, Tater Spyro, if you watch this, hurt those elves. Soften them up for me. I still think uh, we're gonna we're gonna buy at least a lineman. Hey, Stubings. Yeah, I know. Oh man, like when I uh, when that happened, I was like, oh no, you know maybe he'll just roll pushes on his block or something. But in that turn, you you KO'd Pytho, you like killed another guy and badly hurt another. Like it just went awful. Like in one turn, everything turned from like a slightly bad situation to just horrible. Like that set the the tone for the rest of the game. But very well played on your part, though. Uh, you, there were times when I was like, yeah, you pout everybody <laughs> in that turn. But uh, there were a couple times where I was thinking, oh, you know, 
maybe I can sneak in here and get a blitz on the ball and do something, and then you'd move a guy right in the way. It was like you, you had all the spots covered. Your positioning was really solid. So, I, like, you know, after I snake that dodge, uh, I couldn't do anything. But, uh, you know, I was really tempted to not stall. I, I said I had a bad feeling about stalling, but I also didn't think that I could hold you off for five turns after I scored. Um, but I felt that I could hold you off for four turns. So I wanted to stall that one extra turn, and it... Uh, Oh man, it, it did not go well. Thanks, I'm glad I, I at least in the first half kept it to some sort of a game. But I uh, I apologize to everybody else who has to play you the rest of the season for just feeding your orcs SPP this match. How, how much did you get in total? I, I forgot to check, but I mean, you had to get like like at least 15. Yeah, I, I didn't know if you checked the aftermatch stats or not. It'll be hard to remember. Well, actually, I suppose I could just... Now, if I click this, is it going to do a replay? No. Here we go. I can go look at it. So I, I got a whopping six star player points, and you got five, seven, ten, twelve, sixteen, eighteen. That's, that's a nice game for the Arctic Enforcers. I didn't get a chance to check these, so... Our armor was rough, but also this the reason it's so low is because you did a bunch of fouling and you had a ton of uh, mighty blow, so that kind of makes sense. Um, I guess dodges were about right. So is that. See, these, these stats look okay. I think it was just the timing of the ones. Like block dice look fine. Your block dice look normal. Yeah, the stats at the end seem uh, seem pretty normal. Although, you had some nice going for it's there. I could have used a couple ones. <laughs> but overall, no. It was... Uh... Love fouling down TV on Eddie. Yeah, you, uh, you definitely... You dropped me like 200 team value, I think. Luckily, though... Um... Luckily... The key players are still all good. It was most. It was just some linemen you murdered. I was so sad when you murdered that uh, guard block lineman, but there was no way I could use my apo on him that early. But I don't know. At least next next round I play some wood elves, so hopefully they won't murder me. <laughs> There's a lot of elves in this in this uh, division, so I'm kind of excited for that. But I haven't played any yet. I've just been facing bash teams. But yeah, overall, very well played. Despite getting my butt kicked, that was it was still kind of a fun match. I know I probably seemed salty through some of it, but at least in the stream. But uh, it was still a lot of fun. So that's all the Blood Bowl. Yes, yeah, still a chance at Legend. One SPP. We'll see if he if Hawk can get it. I'm excited. I want to see him become Legend. I was. I, I had I had some little outbursts, I think. They weren't too bad, though. Yeah, thanks for tuning in. I suppose we have some people in the stream, so I'll, uh, I'll see if anybody else is streaming some Blood Bowl. Maybe we can kick you over to them. Yeah, see you, Stubings. Thanks for the game. Hope everything goes well with your, your cat and all that. Sorry to hear about that happening. Um... Looks like a bunch of CCL streams. That's good to hear that he's uh, that he's mending. I'm glad to hear that. Um, but yeah, thanks for the thanks again for the game. Um, that's all the Blood Bowl I'll be streaming this weekend. Uh, Monday night though at 7:30 I'll be streaming a clan match. Uh, I'm facing Pro Elves again. Hey, thanks for the follow. Very much appreciated.
but yeah, Monday at 7.30 p.m. Eastern, uh, I'll be streaming uh, the Skull Slinging Slashers versus... What was the name of that Pro Elf team? C Cacophony Crash. So hopefully we can kill some more Pro Elves. See what it, it feels like to be on the other side. But uh, yeah, let's see. We have a couple people in the stream. I'll go ahead and uh, raid... Looks like the Artemis Black is streaming. He's, uh, he's kind of fun to watch. He's pretty fun to watch. I haven't watched him in a long time, but when I did, he was he was very enjoyable. So, I'll send you over to him. And thanks for tuning in. Hopefully, we'll see you guys Monday night.